All Souls Day is a special day in the Christian calendar, observed on November 2nd each year. The day is dedicated to remembering and praying for all the faithful departed, including souls in purgatory awaiting purification before entering heaven. All Souls Day is closely linked to All Saints Day, celebrated on November 1st. While All Saints Day honors the saints, All Souls Day is for all who have died. It reminds Christians of the community of believers extending beyond death. This strengthens the belief in the communion of saints, the unity among the living and the dead in Christ. However, many modern Christians struggle with the concept of All Souls Day due to misunderstandings about the nature of the soul and the afterlife. This essay will explore why this day is difficult to grasp for many today. By understanding these reasons, Christians can better appreciate the significance of All Souls Day. It is a day to remember that we are connected, even in death. In today's world, there is a strong emphasis on individuality, celebrating personal achievements and independence. This focus can lead to misunderstandings about All Souls Day, as many view themselves as isolated beings. This perspective can make it difficult to understand the interconnectedness of souls. Christianity teaches that we are all part of the body of Christ, meaning our lives are interconnected. What happens to one person affects others, a teaching at the heart of All Souls Day. It is a day to remember that we are connected, even in death. Individualism can also make the idea of praying for the dead seem strange. If we see ourselves as entirely independent, we may not understand why we need others' prayers. However, the Christian faith teaches that we support one another through prayer, including praying for those who have died. By recognizing the limitations of individualism, Christians can gain a deeper understanding of All Souls Day. It is a time to remember that we are not alone. We are part of a larger community that transcends even death. This communal aspect is central to the observance of All Souls Day. The interrelatedness of souls is a fundamental concept in Christianity stating that all believers are connected through Christ. This connection does not end with death but continues in the afterlife. All Souls Day reflects this belief, emphasizing that the dead remain part of the Christian community. The idea of interrelatedness is rooted in scripture. In 1 Corinthians 12 verses 12 to 14, Paul describes believers as parts of one body, each essential and working together. This metaphor illustrates how Christians are interconnected, meaning our actions affect others, both in life and after death. Understanding the interrelatedness of souls helps explain the practice of praying for the dead. Since we are all connected, our prayers can aid those who have passed away. This is a powerful expression of love and support, showing that our relationships do not end with death, but continue in a spiritual way. All Souls Day is a reminder of this enduring connection, it calls Christians to remember and pray for their departed loved ones. By doing so, they honor the belief that we are all united in Christ, even beyond the grave. This unity is central to the observance of All Souls Day. Purgatory is a concept that many modern Christians find difficult to understand, often misunderstood or overlooked. Purgatory is believed to be a state of purification for souls not yet ready to enter heaven, this process prepares them for the fullness of heaven. The idea of purgatory is rooted in the Bible and Christian tradition. In 2 Maccabees chapter 12, verse 45, there is a reference to prayers for the dead, suggesting that the dead can benefit from the prayers of the living. The Catholic Church teaches that purgatory is a manifestation of God's mercy, allowing souls to be cleansed of their sins and become worthy of heaven. All Souls Day is closely linked to the concept of purgatory, on this day, Christians pray for the souls in purgatory, asking God to help these souls complete their purification. This practice reflects the belief in the communion of saints, showing that the living can assist the dead through prayer. Understanding purgatory can help modern Christians appreciate All Souls Day. It provides a theological basis for praying for the dead and reinforces the idea of interconnectedness. By praying for the dead, Christians participate in a loving act of support and solidarity. This practice is central to the observance of All Souls Day. Praying for the dead dates back to early Christianity, expressing faith and love. 
Christians believe they can assist the deceased on their journey to heaven. This practice is emphasized on All Souls Day. In 2 Timothy, Paul prays for the deceased Onesiphorus. Prayers for the dead honor loved ones and maintain a spiritual connection. It reflects the belief that we are all part of one spiritual family. This practice is central to All Souls Day observance. Scripture provides a foundation for All Souls Day, supporting the practice of praying for the dead and the belief in the communion of saints. 2 Maccabees describes prayers for the dead, suggesting the deceased can benefit from the living's prayers. 1 Corinthians emphasizes unity and interconnectedness. This illustrates the Christian belief in the communion of saints. All Souls Day calls believers to remember and pray for their departed loved ones. The observance of All Souls Day has a rich history, evolving over centuries and shaped by various cultural and theological influences. Understanding this history can help modern Christians appreciate the significance of the day. The roots of All Souls Day can be traced back to the early Christian practice of commemorating the dead. In the 7th century, the Benedictine monks at Cluny Abbey in France established a day to pray for all the departed. This practice spread throughout Europe and became formally recognized by the Catholic Church. In the Middle Ages, All Souls Day became an important part of the liturgical calendar, marked by special masses, prayers, and visits to cemeteries. The observance of All Souls Day reflects the Church's teaching on the communion of saints and the intercession of the living for the dead. Today, All Souls Day continues to be observed by many Christian denominations, though its significance is often overshadowed by other religious and secular celebrations. By understanding the historical evolution of All Souls Day, modern Christians can reconnect with this important tradition. It is a reminder of the enduring bonds of faith and love that unite the living and the dead. This historical context is central to the observance of All Souls Day. It helps modern Christians appreciate the significance of the day. In contemporary Christianity, the observance of All Souls Day faces several challenges. Many Christians today are unfamiliar with the traditions and practices associated with this day, diminishing its significance. One challenge is the secularization of society, with many people more focused on Halloween, which precedes All Souls Day. The commercial and secular aspects of Halloween often overshadow the religious observance of All Souls Day, leading to a loss of understanding and appreciation for the day. Another challenge is the diversity of Christian denominations, with not all observing All Souls Day in the same way, creating confusion and inconsistency. Additionally, the modern emphasis on individuality can make communal practices like praying for the dead seem less relevant. Despite these challenges, there are ways to revitalize the observance of All Souls Day. Churches can educate their congregations about the history and significance of the day, incorporating special masses, prayers and activities to honor the faithful departed. By doing so, they can help modern Christians reconnect with this important tradition. All Souls Day provides an opportunity to honor and remember departed loved ones. It reinforces the belief that love and faith endure even beyond the grave. This practice is central to the observance of All Souls Day. One of the core teachings of Christianity is the continuity of relationships beyond death, central to All Souls Day. The bonds of love and faith do not end with death but continue spiritually. This unity transcends physical death, connecting us to our departed loved ones. All Souls Day is a powerful expression of this belief. It reflects the Christian hope in resurrection and eternal life. By recognizing this continuity, Christians find comfort and hope. All Souls Day is an important observance in the Christian calendar, dedicated to remembering and praying for the faithful departed. However, many modern Christians struggle to understand its significance due to misunderstandings about individuality, the interrelatedness of souls, and the concept of purgatory. By exploring the historical and theological context of All Souls Day, Christians can gain a deeper appreciation for this tradition. The day is rooted in the belief in the communion of saints and the continuity of relationships beyond death. It calls believers to remember their departed loved ones and to pray for their souls. Despite the challenges posed by modern society, 
there are ways to revitalize the observance of All Souls Day. Churches can educate their congregations and incorporate special activities to honor the faithful departed. By doing so, they can help Christians reconnect with this important tradition and find comfort in the enduring bonds of love and faith. In conclusion, All Souls Day is a powerful reminder of the interconnectedness of all believers, living and dead. It is a day to honor the memory of the departed and to pray for their souls. By understanding its significance, modern Christians can deepen their faith and strengthen their sense of community.